Hey guys, probably the most relevant finance news is actually the Commander's Anthology. So that's getting a reprint, and it's Commander 2011, which the prices have become kind of insane, as I'll show you what Star City Games is trying to charge for one deck. Uh, Commander's Anthology has all the 2011 Commander decks, which have gotten kind of pricey lately. Uh, they will include Heavily in Infernal, which is a $200 deck evasive maneuvers guided by nature and plunder the grave some of these cards are just insane kalia is insane um just a lot of value from just the commanders themselves because they are very popular and i totally agree with them reprinting it and should tank the value of these extremely expensive boxes uh, they will no longer be $200 boxes, the whole set, so you get some dice, and you get four dice, tokens, and all the cards can, in the original decks, so it's really fun if you just want to play with a bunch of friends. It's $164.99, I believe, so about $40 a deck, and then the $4.99 goes for the extra packaging and the dice and stuff like that. It's the regular price that it used to be at, and that's fantastic. I feel like that's exactly where they should reprint. That's the price point they should reprint the anthology sets at. I'm also very happy to see that even though it was 2011, they will do the oldest ones first because they could have tried to do the new ones which are not quite as valuable or even as good, but they decided to do the old ones which have so much value in them. Definitely worth buying in my opinion. Uh, I, the only thing, problem I would have is I wish it was like in a different language. But otherwise, June 9th, uh, 2017, you have the opportunity to buy this. And I think it's worth it. I think it's worth every penny because as we're going to see here, Heavenly Inferno with, um, what is that? Kalia of Vast. That card is expensive. And that entire deck is $200 if you were to buy from Star City Games. Now you can buy the entire set for $164.99. So the entire set costs considerably less than one deck. And it's like you buy this one deck and you get the dice and the tokens and obviously the free other free other decks for for no cost. And that's amazing. Yeah, that's really incredible. So I love it. I think it's great. And this is probably the most relevant finance news is they are not going to be um, the MTG finance for this type of stuff like is not a good investment at all. Anyway, bye guys.